In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the spotlight or the point out effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get right into it. So once you've got Adobe Premiere Pro open, you have a new sequence created and you've got some footage imported into that sequence, we can begin with this spotlight effect. So to begin with, I'm just going to create a spotlight around Big Ben. So to begin with, we're just going to start by creating a brand new adjustment layer. So we're going to new item, adjustment layer, we'll press OK on this menu and we'll drag the adjustment layer onto video layer 2 with your footage on video layer 1. Now from here we'll go over into the opacity tool on the adjustment layer, we'll select ellipse mask and we'll drag this circle over the top of Big Ben. Now from here we'll go into the effects tab, we'll search for levels and we'll drag levels onto the adjustment layer. Now we'll scroll down to the fifth menu down in level, so that's RGB gamma, and we'll pull this down to a smaller number. So we want to reduce the brightness in this layer. So we'll pull the gamma to around 50%, and then just so there's not so much contrast, I'm going to pull the black output level up a little bit, just to remove some of that contrast. Now once you're happy with that, we'll go back into the mask settings, and we'll press the inverted box to make sure that everything is dark except for the circle. So as you see, when we press inverted, only Big Ben is illuminated, everything else is dark, but the edge is a little bit too hard, so we're just going to smooth this out by increasing the mask feather. So pull the mask feather up, as you can see at zero this is hard, but if you pull this all the way up to 70, 100%, the spotlight effect is really soft and diffused. And of course, if we want to animate this on, all we have to do is create a brand new keyframe on the opacity, Pull the number down to 0%. Go ahead in time, maybe five, six, seven keyframes, however long you want, and increase the opacity to 100%. When we play this back, you can see that that is gonna slowly fade in. And if we want to fade this out, all we have to do is create a brand new keyframe at 100%. Go ahead in time and pull this down to 0%. And that will fade in and then fade out. Now I'm just going to show you how to animate this spotlight effect. So let's say we'll have this spotlight following the boat on the river. We're just going to move the mask down on top of the boat. We'll decrease the size of this. And then we'll create a brand new keyframe on mask path. Now we'll just adjust that mask one more time. We'll go ahead towards the end of the movement and we'll just update the position of the mask. So as you can see, all you're really doing here is just updating the position of the mask path to follow the boat. And that is how you do the spotlight effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. It's super easy, it's really fast, and it's a really awesome trick that you might be able to use in a future video. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, check out the previous video, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.